Greetings, YouTube. So as please like, subscribe, and if you enjoy our video, donate to our Patreon. So I'm going to particle test and talk just for a minute about the Hoover Vax machines, which are usually marked with the word air on them. These are machines made for a small area, and they are uh, often fairly lightweight, 14, 15 pounds. Um, you know, it's not a Mila, it's not, you know, German made, but it definitely has a lot of pros over, say, a Dyson or a Shark or something like that. Um, so the first thing, reason why I'm doing this is uh, I actually don't have to do any tools to break down the majority of the cyclone if the user needed to clean it, uh, which I think is something that is so overlooked uh, on so many vacuums, is that inevitably the cyclone needs to be washed or cleaned. So for the customer to be able to get to that and do that, I think is super important. Um, so that's a feature that Hoover has on a lot of their vacuums these days, and I think that's pretty important. Um, everything's uh, as uh, asymmetrical and has little eccentric points and things back together. So I'm going to show you, first of all, clean filter, clean cyclones. Um, that just sits there and, uh, you know, see what they say to do. I would wash that every time. Um, they say every two months. I would say every time or every other time at least. Um, no different than a Dyson. And I would also change the HEPA filter on a regular basis of about three to six months. Um, so this HEPA filter has a gasket that's captive in here and sits in there. So we're going to put that on. Really all getting very easy to, to do. It kind of hides under there. It says the word HEPA, but a lot of customers can find that for whatever reason. Um, these machines are pretty loud. Not a huge fan of that, but we're going to particle test it now. Um, start by what's in the air. As always. And we're going to turn the machine on. As you see, there is a budget machine that will blow a zero on the particle counter. Um, and it's no surprise, it's a sealed HEPA system. It will blow a zero. Uh, would I recommend this to allergy sufferers? Absolutely not. And I'll tell you why. You still have to go out and empty this. Now, if you have a spouse or you have somebody who can do this for you, then you could probably get along uh, if you suffered severe allergies. Or if you had minor allergies, you probably could get along with this. But you still have to go outside and dump that. So that's something that can create dust. Uh, but other than that, um, I mean these machines, they pick up alright. They don't uh, they do not do high pile carpet. They're not uh, made to be anything, you know, but meat and potatoes. But it gets the job done. And if you had an apartment or something that was less than a thousand square feet, uh, I could see this being an option, especially if you're on a budget. These can be had under 200 bucks usually. So, as always, please like, subscribe, uh, and comment below. And again, follow that link to the Patreon, the Patreon page if you want to see more videos like this.